Hello, welcome to the warehouse guys. I'm explaining to you today Spa Marvel, which is a sanitizer system for your tub. 50% of the people that I sell this to use nothing but Spa Marvel. The other 50% I don't know exactly what the numbers are, but are supplementing with bromine. Health Canada will say when using any sanitizer there should be a sanitizer of chlorine or bromine in there to assist it if it's an all natural product. Personally, I use nothing but Spa Marvel. I only use the tub three to five times a week though. I go in my birthday suit so I don't have a lot of action going on in the tub kind of deal. Um, you make your own choice. I'll explain both ways of doing it. You have here, it's a three part system. You have your conditioner which is your main sanitizer for three months. Then you have your filter cleaner, which should be used at a minimum of once a month. A lot of people do it twice a month, some do it every week. I'm about once a month, but I will um, sometimes take out the filter if I notice that it's dirty and just clean it under the sink. But uh, I'll get back to that. And then your cleanser, which is when you go to dump your water. If you're using exclusive bromine or chlorine, your water's good for three to five months. You have to dump it, start again. If you are doing Spa Marvel, you're good for about nine months to a year, so you get a long time out of your water. Uh, the three month conditioner. Easy peasy when you're starting up a new tub. If you have bought a brand new tub and it doesn't have old water in it, I don't use the, the cleanser. Um, so if you're getting a brand new tub, first thing you want to do is take this, put it into the middle of the tub, turn on all your pumps, close the actual cover and the pump will turn off automatically in 15 to 20 minutes. That'll circulate all this through the tub in a couple of minutes kind of deal. Um, that is what you want to do with your three month conditioner. It's really all you have to do. Once a month, once every two weeks, you have your filter cleaner. Take a cap full of this per filter, put it in a bucket that's a greater size than the filter. So you need a bucket about this high kind of deal. Put a cap full in there, mix it around, put the filter in every couple of hours. If you can remember, come in, swish the puppy around the next day, 24 hours later, take it out, clean it under the sink. You now have a clean filter. Very, very important to clean your filters in a spa, regardless of what chemicals you're using and how clean or dirty you think your tub is. You don't get a lot of debris in your tub because your cover's on it all the time. There's not leaves falling when you're in the tub or you take them out. It's not the dirt and the debris you want to get in the filter, it's the organic that's blocking the media. It's a porous material and the water is drawn through it by the pump. If you have organics in it, it's harder for the water to draw through. So if your pump works theoretically under optimum circumstances, at 2000 RPM let's say, if you don't clean your filter for a month, she's working at 2100, 22, she's working at higher than it should be. So clean your filters, it's going to give longevity to your spa, it's like the oil change on a car. Clean your filters using a filter cleaner, this one if you're using Spa Marble. Then from there you have your dump. If it comes time to dump your water, you'll know when because it kind of goes funky, you'll, you'll, you'll just know. When that happens, um, I want you to take this product, pour it into the middle of the tub, turn on your pumps, walk away. It says to let it wait 24 hours because you're it's it's expecting to go into filtration mode four or six hours through that day so it'll go through the system on low. I prefer, whenever you can think about it, go out to your tub, the top side control, turn on one or both of your pumps. If you have two pumps, turn on both, close the lid, walk away, they'll go off automatically in 15 to 20 minutes. It's now going through the pumps at high speed, it's cleaning the heater core, the plumbing, all the joints, this, that, and everything else. It's not really the cleanser to clean the uh, acrylic of the tub or the body of water, it's meant to clean the innards. It's very important to do that when you're dumping your water. You have your filter cleaner, as I've explained, you want to use that once a month, if not every two weeks, cleaner, healthier for the tub, and this is your product you want to use every three months. I put it in about every two and a half, but you make your choice on what you want to do. It says every three months. Health Canada says to use a sanitizer. So when you first get the tub delivered, if you bought the tub from us, the person dropping off the tub will explain this to you and is going to tell you to pour this into the middle once you fill up the tub and put in a tablespoon or two of bromine and put in a tablespoon once a week. If you're using a lot of it, you got the honeymoon stage going on, you got kids, you got the Kool-Aid house, well, it's going to need a little bit of help, use some bromine. If it's a husband and wife, no one ever uses it, you go in your birthday system so suit, you can, uh, you'll figure out if you want a tablespoon, if you want a teaspoon, if you want half a teaspoon, if you don't want any, go on from there. 
That Spa Marvel here, we uh, recommend all three, of course, and the granular bromine, even if you're not going to use it, because if you are going to sometime get cloudy water, it's going to help. It's nice to have on the shelf in the back. Uh, very important with your tub, some tips with Spa Marvel. One, your filtration system should be at six hours. All spas, when you buy them in North America, the majority thereof, have a default of four hours a day. Depending on your filtration, it's going to give you four hours, it'll say four hours, and it's going to give you two hours every 12 hours. So over 24 hours, giving you four hours. That's your default. Or it might say two hours twice, depending on your filter. If you look in your manual, it'll explain your filtration system. You can just go in and change it. Make sure it's on standard and make sure it's on, I would say, six inches at uh, six hours. It defaults to four. So if the power goes off, she's going to go back to four hours. So always give it up to six hours. If you're having water that's cloudy or this problem, that problem, the first thing you do is clean your filter. Then from there, up your filtration. Instead of coming and buying chemicals off the shelf, and God love you if you do, but personally what I would do is I would up my filtration to 8, 10, 12 hours for 2, 3 days and then bring it back to the 6 hours because you don't want to pay for the extra hydro. I would prefer to spend $1.25 at the hydro company than spending $5 here at the chemical company. So, if you ever get water that's not exactly the way you want it, clean your filters, up your filtration. Spa Marvel works very well and is activated with the introduction of air. So you don't need an air pump in your spa. On the top side of your control, there's usually small little dials. And that small little dial, when you turn it on, when that pump is on, the jets become stronger and you can see the water coming out of the jet now because the air is trying to escape so it makes more of a white bubble. So when your air control is off, you can see where the jets are working, but you can't really see how many or what's going on. If you turn on the air control, you now see exactly where the jets are because the air is trying to escape. So if you leave that on when you're not in the spa, when the filtration cycle happens or heat happens, you'll inadvertently get air, it will just happen. So if you have water that you're not happy with, clean the filter up the filtration to 8, 10, 12 hours, bring it back a couple days later, and then from there, tablespoon of bromine and the air controls. Make sure the air controls are on and go from there. This is the Spa Marvel. You have your cleanser, you have your filter cleaner, and you have your three-month uh, conditioner. You can supplement with bromine. I'll let you make those choices. Health Canada recommends that you use it. Then you have your filters which are the life breath of your system, very, very important. This is your oil change, Spa Marvel, in a nutshell. My name is Peter. You can call the office at any time, 519-951-0554. You can call, ask to speak directly to me. If you can't get a hold of you, they'll hold me, they'll give you my cell number. You can call back or call me on my cell. More than happy to answer all your questions. If you bought the tub here or not, or you live in Timbuktu, I don't care. It only takes me a minute to help you. Give me a call, more than happy to help, warehouseguys.com. Have a great day.